Joining us tonight, I'm Dia Wall. For the first time tonight, a local bar is reopening after a deadly shooting. It's been three days since Srinivas Kuchibotla was shot and killed at Austin's Bar and Grill in Olathe. Two others were also injured. The accused shooter, Adam Purinton, is facing murder charges and possibly a hate crime charge, depending on the FBI's investigation. Purinton will be in court on Monday. But tonight, those at Austin's Grill are hoping to get back to normal. 41 Action News reporter Allie Hoxie is joining us live. And Allie, there's a memorial that's still growing outside the bar right there. Yes, absolutely. This memorial is growing. Take a look. It's been growing throughout the day. Inside, there's been words of encouragement. And I know that what happened on Wednesday is not, is not normal. Doors to Austin's Bar and Grill opened at 11 a.m. On Wednesday, a gunman shot and killed Trinu Kuchibotla inside the bar. Alok Madasani and Ian Grillet were also shot and are still recovering from their injuries. Today, people working for Garmin, where two of the three men worked, stopped in. You know, despite the tragedy, it's, it's, uh, I think it's within the human spirit to, to, to come together and support each other in times of difficulty, and I just wanted to show my support here. Regulars also stopped in. You know, when my husband found out that Ian um, was the guy who stepped in, he said, I'm not at all surprised any of the regulars would have done the same thing. The bar's owners say they will be back to their regular hours from here on out. We've never experienced anything like this. I don't know anybody that has, but uh, we're, we're just, today's the day we're deciding to, that uh, we should try to move on and try to bring on some normalcy. We want to support the Austin's family and we want nobody to be afraid to come here. The mayor of Olathe also stopped in today. Reporting live in Olathe, Ali Hoxie, 41 Action News. Thanks, Ali. Overseas in India, dozens held a vigil for Srinivas Kuchibotla, who died in the Olathe shooting. They held signs saying that we do not support politics of hate.